what some are calling the other royal wedding. It brought Britain's royal family back together at Windsor Castle today. Just five months after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle tied the knot, the Queen's granddaughter, Princess Eugenie, married her Take British you, prince. CBS 4's Gwen Baumgartner has the story from Windsor, my England. Wedded husband. Wedding fever swept through Windsor along with 60 mile per hour gusts that blew off fascinators and swept page boys and bridesmaids off their feet. Once safely inside St. George's Chapel, Princess Eugenie married tequila executive Jack Brooksbank in a lavish ceremony. I, Eugenie Victoria Helena. The bride is ninth in line to the British throne and daughter of Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson. It's the first time the royal family has been seen together since Prince Harry and Meghan married at the same venue in May. For this ceremony, the Duchess wore blue. Princess Eugenie is known for her bold fashion statements, donning show-stopping fascinators alongside her sister Beatrice. But for her wedding day, she chose simplicity and elegance. You kind of question with her and her sister where there's why they wear the things they do sometimes, the choices they make, but I think that's really nice. Thousands of well-wishers line the streets of Windsor. For some, it's British tradition. We came for Harry and Meghan's wedding. We also came for Charles and Camilla's wedding back in the day. Um, so we always visit Windsor when there's a royal wedding on. The guest list was even bigger than Harry and Meghan's. 800 people were invited for Eugenie and Jack's big day. Among them, a slice of Hollywood, including Demi Moore, Liv Tyler, and Naomi Campbell. Following the ceremony, Princess Eugenie and her new husband took a romantic carriage ride through the historic town. Gwen Baumgartner, CBS News, Windsor. I could watch that forever. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun so, to watch those royal weddings. Yeah, I love that. Now, the new couple will continue to live and work in London. They recently moved into a cottage at Kensington Palace right next door to Prince Harry and Meghan. So if you want to borrow some royal sugar, just knock <laughs> on the door. Borrow some sugar. Yeah, the newlyweds can all hang out together. Absolutely. It's nice. Maybe they do.